Now let's take a look at the Spontania user interface. In the lower left hand corner we have the text chat window. Here you can send a message to the group or an individual. In the center of the screen we have two slider bars, one to adjust the microphone volume, the other to adjust the speaker volume. Clicking on the next button will open up the device configuration menu. If you're the moderator, you will have a record button. Next to that is the raised hand icon. The next three buttons will turn on or off your mic, speaker, and camera. To share an application, simply click this button. When someone is sharing an application, this icon will become active. Clicking on it will request remote desktop control. Click here to launch the whiteboard application. Click this button to transfer files to all participants in the call. The next button allows you to add additional participants to the call. And clicking on this button will end the call. Click here to open up the options menu for more features and settings. The help button will open up a browser-based complete manual on Spontania. The little bar graph in the lower right hand corner indicates the connection quality. Clicking on it will show the network usage. The number of users connected as well as your session ID or conference room number is indicated at the very top center of the screen. Click on the I for more information on this session as well as a URL link that can be copied and pasted and sent to others to join this conference.